Here's a quick demonstration of my uh, e-bike, which is uh, a BMX Haro that I got years ago, and I just wasn't using it, so I converted electric. Um, as you can see here, uh, it's got two 10 amp hour, 12 volt batteries for 24 volt system, a 250 watt electric motor, and my bike is set up so you can still pedal it. As you can see, uh, motor tied into the frame that goes back to I call it a jack shaft uh, I turned it in to a jack shaft essentially what this piece is here is what this is on this little electric bike here all I had to do was take out the spokes and weld on another sprocket on this side and then this attached two pieces of angle iron and that's it um, so yeah there you go pretty pretty cool setup uh, max speed is I would have to say around 17 or 18 miles an hour and with 20 amp hours I'm, I'm looking to get around maybe 13 to 14 maybe 15 miles depending on how much I start and stop uh, speed controller is not like a potentiometer it's just it it kind of uh, dampens the, um, you know, the the first initial start so that it doesn't go full blast and then it just goes to full power all the time which I don't like but hey I'm gonna upgrade in the future and I just bought these batteries they're really nice um, other than that um, let me give you a quick demonstration see if I can do this Hopefully you saw that. Anyhow, let's we'll see if I can ride it in my basement here. Currently it's snowing outside and I don't necessarily like driving e-bikes in the snow. So There you go. I'm going to have a uh, riding video soon. This is basically it so far. It's, you know, it's decent. It works great. 250 watts isn't much, but if you're looking for something, for something to have fun around on, you're uh, on a tight budget. There you go. You know, just get your bike, get a parts bike, and then just do a lot of fabrication. Um, some angle iron and some flat stock, and hopefully you have a welder. It makes things easier. But if you don't, you just through bolt it. If you have any questions, please ask, and uh, I'll be uh, more than happy to help you. Gotta love the seat. Very comfortable. Anyway, thanks for watching.